In this video, we will be learning how to play Jingle Bells on the GCEA tuning of ukulele. So either for a tenor or soprano or concert ukulele. I actually made a chord sheet for this, so if you want to follow along on something that you can see more easily, I will have a PDF of this on my Patreon. Hey! We're gonna go through how to play the chords nice and slow for part of the video, so if you find that you are going at a faster pace, please, please feel free to use the timestamps in the description of this video to skip ahead to the part of the video that serves you the best. All that being said, let's get started. We're gonna start with the chorus of Jingle Bells, and we're gonna start on C, which is third finger, on the A string, third fret, very nice. We're going to do that three times. C, two, three. And then I have the option on my sheet, if you want to, for one beat, go to C7. That's first finger down, first fret. That kind of helps us lead into the F chord, which will be first finger down on the E string, second finger down on the G string. So we'll go C7, F, C7, F. We're going to try C, C7, F, starting on C. Ready, go. C, C7, F. See if you can do that on its own. And then we'll go back to C. And then D7, which is going to be, you move your third finger to the E string 2nd fret, 2nd finger to the G string 2nd fret. This is not a complete chord. I use this voicing because it's easier and it's, we're only doing it for like one beat. So I don't see the need to have every single voice. So we're going to go D7. And then we're going to go to G7. So we're going to put down our first finger on that E string and then move these two fingers just one string up. We're going to try that again. D7, ready, go. And switching to G7, ready, go. And back to D7, ready, go. And back to G7, ready, go. And then we're going to go back to C and we're going to do that process, most of that again. So we're going to go C for three beats. One, two, three. Here's C7. Here's F. One, two, back to C. And then G7. And then C. Now we'll do the chorus with all our chords, just one strum per beat. We'll go one, two, start on C. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. Hey! Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open and that's the chorus. The nice news is that for the verses, we only have one new chord, and it really doesn't move as fast, I think, as the chorus. So that's pretty nice. So again, we're going to start on C, and we're going to do that three times. So one, two, three, then switch to F. Now for D minor, we haven't done this yet, we're going to stay on F, add third finger to the C string, second fret, and that's D minor. So just one change. The nice thing about this transition is we're going to keep first finger here. We're going to move third finger to the A string for G7, and then we're going to move second finger one string up. So let's just practice that transition, D minor to G7. So we're only moving these two fingers, we're keeping first finger still. Let's try that together. 
One, two, start on D minor now. One, two, and switch to G7. One, two, going back to D minor. One, two, back to G7. One, two, back to D minor. One, two, back to G7. One, two, three, four. Let's do C. That's pretty much it, so we'll do that one more time. So we'll do that one more time. We're gonna go C, 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 and switch to F, D minor. Now we're gonna go to C, and then G7, and then C, G7. So if you don't have C to G7, nice and smooth and fluid, now is the time to practice it and really get that down because you're going to want to be able to play that if you want to play the ukulele. So we're going to start C, 2, 3, G7, 1, 2, switch to C, 1, 2, switch to G7, 1, 2, switch to C, 2 beats, 1, 2, 1, 2, 1, 2, 1, 2, Here's one beat, now ready, go. C, G7, C, G7, C, G7, C. Obviously, I have a lot of experience in playing these chords, so if you found that difficult, do not feel like you are um, in any way not normal, because I have a lot of experience. The, the smaller your movements, the smoother your transition is going to be, so practice making your movements as small and smooth as possible. Let's go through the verse nice and slow. Starting on C. One, two, ready, go. Dashing through the snow in a one-horse open sleigh. Here's D minor. Over the fields we go, laughing all the way. Bells on bobtails ring. Making spirits bright What fun it is to ride and sing a sleighing song tonight Oh Let's do some strumming patterns. I like to go down, down, up, down, down, up, down for lots of my strumming songs. That just, for me, helps the motion move forward a little bit. So let's try that together. We're just going to stick on the C chord, or you don't have to play a chord as we practice this. I use my two fingernails hitting the string to go down, and then my thumb to go up. So let's try that slow together. We're going to go down. I'm going to go twice as fast. So let's try down. So that's the motion I'm going to be using. If you are not there yet, if you're only working on getting the chords, just practice those chords and we're going to do a play along now. So let's get started. I'm going to start on C, and we're just going to do our riff and start the chord progression when we start singing. So here's C.
found this video helpful in your journey of learning Jingle Bells. And um, if you would like to support this channel, you can always subscribe. I do a lot of different kinds of music videos, um, not just ukulele tutorials. Um, so if you want to check that stuff out, I would love it if you did. I play a lot of wind instruments. So if not, that's okay. We can still be friends. Until next time, stay mindful, stay musical, and stay out of trouble.